just come before your holy throne. We ask that you forgive us of our sins we have committed against you and against those made in your image. Father, I ask right now according to your word in Psalm 34, verse 7, that you keep your angels around all of us here in this broadcast, around our loved ones, family members, ministry partners, in-laws, ex-in-laws and friends, to protect us and keep us safe from any form of retaliation or attacks of the devil and his demons. And we declare Isaiah 54, 17, no weapon formed against us shall prosper in the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ, we pray. Tonight, we're going to be arresting demons. Tonight, we're going to be handcuffing evil spirits, especially those that rob us financially. There are demons assigned to rob. Jesus said in John 10:10, 10, 10, the thief comes to steal, kill, and destroy. He comes to steal money. He comes to steal prosperity. He comes to steal your health. Okay? He also comes to kill. Okay? And he also comes to destroy. Okay? Destroy everything. That's the game of the devil. The devil has demons assigned only to rob people financially. And tonight, we are going to exercise the authority of the name of Jesus Christ. And we are going to go after these devils. I'm going to be arresting demons here because I have authority on earth to arrest demons. I have authority on earth to bind demons. I have authority on earth to drive them out. Okay, and I'm going to be using my authority to go after evil spirits. Okay, now, before we go any further, if you like to participate with me, okay, in order for us to disarm Satan, we must be givers, friends. We must be givers. The Bible talks about giving, it shall be given to you, good measure, pressed down, shaken together and running over. The Bible has many verses about giving, giving to the poor. Whoever gives to the poor lends to God. You cannot be blessed financially if you are not a giver. I'm going to encourage those of you who would like to participate, okay? If you are not a regular giver, become, become one. And tonight I'm going to challenge you to give at least $10 into this ministry because I'm going to be the one going after your demons, okay? I'm going to encourage you. You don't have to do it right now. Do it after the prayer is over, okay? But I want you to make a commitment to do something, okay? If you give something tonight, you are going to be in the game, okay? You're going to be a giver, okay? That's the way it is. The Bible says, give and it shall be given to you. Once we arrest demons, then money will start flowing your way. Sales that you need, extra sales. Okay? Higher commission, higher income. Then you can dream of getting a better job. And you should dream about it. Okay? Don't allow evil spirits to rob you. Don't allow evil spirits to take your blessings away from you. Okay? You can go below the video. You can go below the video. There's a PayPal link there. You can make a donation there. Okay. Or you can go to brothercarlos.com, the website below here. Amen. And now we're going to go after demons. Now we're going to go after them. Now we're going to arrest them on your behalf. Okay. And I am believing once these demons are arrested, they are handcuffed. Okay. Then you are going to get what you want. What is that that you want? Do you want a, a better job? Do you want to own your own business? Do you want to prosper in your business? There are many business people that watch me regularly that are not prospering. And now let's go after demons, okay? The Bible says in the book of Luke chapter 10, verse 19, I have given you authority to trample on snakes and scorpions and to overcome all the power of the enemy and nothing will harm you. That includes financial demons. That includes breaking financial curses. That includes, okay, just uh, uh, arresting and handcuffing, okay, those who have been robbing, killing, and stealing. All right? So now we're going to exercise authority over these evil spirits. Would you like to be blessed? Then be open, okay? Be open, all right? Be receptive. And be ready now to lose your devils because now we're going to go after them. The Bible says also in the book of Matthew, chapter 16, verse 19, whatever you bind on earth is bound in heaven. Whatever you loose on earth 
is loosed in heaven. I'm going to bind your demons and I'm going to lose your financial blessings to come your way. I'm going to lose you to prosper. Okay? But before I lose you to prosper, I'm going to arrest your evil spirits that have been robbing you and also keeping you from being a giver. A giver. Amen? In the name of Demas, look in my eyes right now, devils. I'm speaking to you right now. Those of you that have been robbing us, those of you that have been uh, 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 hindering financial blessings from coming our way, those of you who have been distracting buyers and also donors from buying from us and also from keeping, you know, from, from keeping, you know, them from donating to us. I am coming now against you by the power and the authority of the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ, evil spirits, I now bind you, I arrest you, I handcuff you, and I pull you out of these people. I pull you out of myself. I pull you out of our family members. Come out! Come out, financial demons. Come out, financial demons. Come out, financial demons. I arrest you. I handcuff you. I bind you. I knock you down. I knock you out by the power and the authority of the name of Jesus Christ. Come out of that person right there. Come out of that person right there. Come out of me. Come out of their family members. Come out of my family members. Get out of their homes. Lose their finances, lose their banking accounts, lose their jobs, lose their clients, lose their income. Lose it now in Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. Come out, evil spirits. Come out and go to the pit. I arrest you now and I confine you now to eternal prison in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Come out! I see demons coming out now. I see demons now losing your money. <coughs> I see demons right now losing what they were blocking before. Money from coming to your hands. You're gonna see it. It's coming in your hands. It's gonna come to you. I'm gonna. I, I am already seeing salespeople here making more sales and prospering more than before. You gotta believe it. The word of God. You got to believe the power of God. You got to believe the power in the name of Jesus Christ. Okay? Believe it. And the blessings will come your way. All right? These demons are now bowing down. They are coming out of you. They are losing your money. Lo uh, losing your money right now. What belongs to you? Come out, evil spirits. Come out, financial demons. Demons robbing people of their dr dreams. Their accomplishments, their goals, their investments. Come out! Come out, evil spirits! Do not block people from investing in real estate. I see people here investing in real estate and also prospering. Come out, evil spirits! Come out, evil spirits! Come out, evil spirits! Come out! I also see demons here blocking people from getting good jobs, from getting you know, high-paying jobs, getting a good job right there, from making good money. I see these demons right now. They've been with you for a long time. They have been blocking you and binding you. But these devils now have to flee. And remember the commitment that you made at the beginning of the broadcast. To be a giver. Be a giver. Okay? Do what the word of the Lord tells you to do. Okay, and the, as you, if you become a giver, you're going to keep these devils at bay. You're going to keep them away from you. Go by the word of God. Okay, don't go by what your neighbors tell you. Go by the word of God, the principles of the word of God. Come out, evil spirits. Come out, evil spirits. Come out. Demons keeping people unemployed. Get out. Keep Demons keeping people impoverished. Get out. Demons keeping people now begging the government for help. Get out! Get out! Get out! Come out! Come out, evil spirits! Come out, evil spirits! Get out now! Go to the pit! I handcuff you! I bind you! I restrain you! And now you are handcuffed for eternity! You are bound for eternity! 
Lose our money. Lose our finances. Do not interfere with our financial blessings. Do not hinder anyone from giving us money or from buying from us. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. Say amen. Say amen. Take a deep breath three times right now. More demons are going to come out of you right now. Come out, devils. Come out, devils. Come out, devils. Say, I'm free. I'm a giver. I'm going to honor my father. I'm going to do what the word of the Lord says for me to do. Say, I'm blessed. These devils just left me. Now my financial blessings are coming my way. And they will come my way. I will prosper. I will be successful in everything I do. In Jesus mighty name. Say amen. Amen. I'm going to encourage you to sow at least $10. To break that poverty cycle. Okay. So those demons will not have power to come back to you. And they will not have power to block your blessings from coming to your hands. You can sow $10 or higher in be below the video at the PayPal link there. Or at BrotherCarlos.com, the website right here. Amen.